All right, let's play Lynx Crossbow Training Yay! that I got for five bucks at Staples. Hold Wii Zapper securely with both hands. All right. So again, I do oh, not know citrus. anything about this off. game. <laughs> okay. Ta. Have fun. Cheerio. Verily. So I guess uh, in this game, Link has a crossbow, and he's gonna shoot some guys up. Yep. Sure. Why not? Kill. I should make sure my sensor bar is actually proper. I have to sit so far away from my monitor to play this. So there's no story mode? What is this? Well, that's me's. I don't... I think that might be, like, a high score thing? Or on target practice. Hit the bullseyes as they pop up, consecutive hits boost your score. Hmm, I should have increased the target. Cursor speed. So, does the game feel like uh, Time Crisis? I never played Time Crisis. Time Crisis? Never played Time Crisis! Huh, I thought we'd be walking along the ground. But I think they just we're just floating through like the Twilight Princess maps. Get Nintendo land, man. But does it work on a normal Wii? You should get a Wii U, man. But there's no game on there that he wants. He wants Nintendo land, he just don't know it. Are you sure? I'm very certain, dude. That game is amazing. Shoot the stealth force as they rise from the desert sand. Don't let yourself get surrounded. This is a really boring game. <laughs> it reminds me of the bow. Um, the bow archery game in um, Majora's Mask, though. I like that. Man, why do you wish... have... I wish there was more archery stuff to do in Twilight Princess. And there was a lot of archery stuff to do in Twilight Princess, I just wish there was more. That was like... the best part of the motion controls in Twilight Princess. And like... That's actually one area where... Twilight Princess is better than Skyward Sword because, like, Twilight Princess, you get the bow in, like, the second dungeon game. But by the time you get the bow in Skyward Sword, it's, like, already halfway through the game, man. Or even more than that. Hmm. Let's try shooting my left hand. Move the control stick Are and you defeat left handed?
Oh yeah, that's a little awkward. See, you still gotta turn with the stupid, um, by pointing the Wiimote to the side, which is really dumb. Like, who thought this was a good idea, to have it so you couldn't turn by moving the stupid control stick? I don't know, I've never played the game. Like, seriously, the cursor? Oh yeah, that's really gonna help. It's no wild guns. Really? Really? Really what? My problem is once you turn, you lose your, your cursor position. So you don't shoot things off screen. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny actually. Just end up killing all the enemies. Can't even see what you're doing. <laughs> this is gonna be like the <laughs> quickest let's play we have. I don't know how I can stomach any more of this crap. Why are you even, are you seriously gonna make it a let's play? I was, I was seriously gonna go to level three and keep going. I thought it was like okay. you know, super easy, right? I thought it'd be like, oh you just you you're on rails, right? It's a rail shooter. But it's not really a rail shooter. And the weed it's a little hard to have precision with the weed. Probably wouldn't recognize the motion plus, would it? Where are they getting those targets from? They're pulling it right out of there. Why is it placed near their. Ah, fuck. Because the loincloths are not enough. Really shooting them in that area. It's just really weird. This is this is the um, Sephirons become men. They need to prove that's that they, they have the daring to have someone shoot at them in the crotch. If they flinch, then they're a real they're man. All Flinching, they're like getting knocked back, but up until you know you hit them, they're just like pretty much poker face. Up, 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 poker. No. I wonder what you unlock with the target score. Nothing. They're probably like, if you don't, <laughs> you don't get the target score, you don't unlock any more levels. <laughs> You just get bragging rights. See, now this is what I expected the whole game to be, where you're on rails. Uh, of course, still gotta move left and right with the stupid motion this, jump. I think this is actually the part that I've seen advertised. Well, of course, right? It's the easiest one. Fun. Wait a minute, was this an actual mini game in the thing where you have to shoot the boss? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Also, um, Key and the infinite bomb arrows glitch. Shoot the skulls, consecutive hits will boost your score. This reminds you of Skyward Sword. Oh, 
How, how do you go from skulls to pumpkins, anyway? It's a mini-game. Well, I'm just saying, you know, you got skulls in this one. I mean, that's pretty grotesque. I mean, they're throwing these skulls just Fine, like, fine. Oh. Both of them are Halloween-y. Oh, oh, okay. I get it. That makes sense. I mean, you still, you gotta wonder, how many, how many creatures had to die for this minigame to be possible? Seems, seems cruel. Alright, well, let's try the third one. Hit the bullseyes as quickly as you can. Boy, I'm beginning to sense a, a trend here. I like the bullseyes portion. Why don't you just get Nintendo Land? I don't have a Wii U. Why don't you just get a Wii U? Okay, you give him the money. <laughs> oh no, yeah, no, suddenly, you know, I'm the, the rich one. to see they actually use these assets again for something. I guess. Seems a little lazy though. That could be cool if they added, you know, stuff from other games. Not exactly how no wonder this was only work. like friggin' five dollars. Even the Wii Zapper is a little awkward to hold. Shoot the fruit balloons! Oh come Wait, on. Do you have to use the Wii Zapper? You don't have to. Just, it's, 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 like the Wii Zapper does have the trigger, right? What fruit balloons? What does this even have to do with like Zelda? Is this to like they copy friggin' Fruit Ninja? Oh, no, no, they were, they were Fruit Ninja before game. Fruit Ninja was a thing. Although that was like Lake Hylia, not. Town, so. My theory is that whenever Hyrule celebrates a Twilight Princess, they have fruit balloons. But since we're playing Twilight Princess where there's no time to celebrate, there are no fruit balloons. Don't they celebrate at the end of Twilight Princess? Not really. Do you see it? Like, we don't see them, don't, do we? We just see them living daily lives and. <laughs> then Midna going away, and it's all sad. Someone the majority, forget. Of, the majority of stuff that goes on in Twilight Princess pretty much just goes unnoticed, you know? A swarm of Kargar rocks are attacking. Defend yourself! You can't defend. These stationary ones are more fun. So you like you don't have to pay attention to your movement. Yeah. It's just awkward when they try to add movement. Yes. That's how time prices plays. Well I don't you like it because you have to take cover. Problem and is the problem is, this is supposed to promote the Wii Zapper. If they designed it around just using the Wii how it normally is, they could have used the Lunch Chuck for moving. You yeah, it's a little awkward.
Hey Dave. Yeah, I finally finished uh, NaNoWriMo, so I can stream again. I kind of took a break in November. Earn a medal in the previous level to unlock this one? <laughs> okay, it's time nope. to, come to come Screw to you, game. And that's how you play Link's Crossbow Training. Yes, so no one ever get this game. I mean, if you even see this for $5, it's not worth $5. This is terrible, actually, in my it's opinion. It's not even worth it if they pay you to take it. The, the only thing worth playing in this I game was that last it. one with the Karok. Or the I Goroks. Guess, but... And it's like, you have to go through so much crap just to play that. Not really, I think you could probably, you could have just gone to that one first. No, you have to, when you select well, you a level, you have to go through three gone stages. Through two, but you know, you could have gone straight to the third level, anyway. <laughs> Alright, well thanks for watching this Let's Play everyone, I'm Caleb, this has been Awesome Canadian Gamers Ventcast Let's on, Play of Link's Crossbow Training. Yeah. Put up Cave Story. Mm.